Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we are doing the review of uh, another of East Tops harmonica, uh, which is a very famous one called uh, Forerunner. This is a 12 hole uh, chromatic harmonica again. I've done a previous video about uh, East Top King Dream, and this is like a follow up video to a uh, similar product which is from East Top, which is a Chinese company, and these harmonicas are good quality harmonicas made in China and uh, I'll first start talk up, talking about what it comes in. It comes into uh, in a corrugated box when it comes shipped to you and uh, it comes in this perfect plastic case. The model number for Forerunner is 1248NV and NV stands for uh, non valve so, when you open up this harmonica, uh, there are no valves in it or no, probably no wind savers, that is how you talk about NV, that is what it means. Uh, the case inside is lined perfectly with a velvet finish and it comes with an East Top branded cleaning cloth and it comes with a bit of uh, literature which is again in uh, probably all in Chinese so you have to use Google Translate probably so yeah so full points again for uh, giving a perfect case uh, along with the harmonica to keep it safe and it's a durable case plastic case uh, perfectly lined it's a great fit inside so, no shaking or no damages to, to the harmonica, especially when you are traveling with this. Um, so, yeah, let us talk about the basic construction of the Forerunner itself. Now, the feel of this uh, cover plates is just beautiful. It has a grey colored uh, coating with a semi matte finish kind of a of a powder coating or a spray paint kind of a feel and it just feels very nice, smooth to touch. If you see the construction, it is similar to the 12 hole East Top uh, King Dream. Uh, it has the, again the same smooth slider which is uh, again with just two pieces. So, you have a rounded mouthpiece and just the slider plate that is it. So, that fits straight towards on, on the comb and which makes it airtight as well. The comb material, this is again ABS plastic, uh, good solid weight to it and it is a good feel in your hands. Not very heavy, not very light, but just the perfect heft. Now. In terms of sound, as a non-valved uh, non uh, harmonica, this is probably more brighter than the ones which are already valved and uh, the reason for it is probably because you need to blow a bit of more air into it. So, because there are no valves in it, definitely the reed plates get the responses quickly and it just fires up. So, it is a bit more brighter. that is the sound. Uh, in terms of air tightness, this is a pretty air tight instrument which is very good to play for a harmonica. Um, the construction quality I would say uh, is very similar to the King Dream, but I feel the King Dream is a bit higher in terms of the specifications and in terms of the materials used. Uh, the Forerunner is something which can be a pr uh, practice harp. It is an entry level chromatic harmonica and uh, this particular one is you cannot call it like a professional grade, but it is a semi professional grade at an entry level and it sounds nice. It is a very good uh, practice instrument, especially if you are on a budget and uh, let us see how it sounds once again. I will do a sound test uh, once without using the slider and then once 
after using the slider. The slider is smooth, no sound, no clicks, no noises. The spring tension is just perfect. It's very smooth to operate. Uh, slight clicking towards this end uh, of the slider. This side is pretty smooth, but it might be just in this particular one piece which I have received. Maybe yours would not have that clicking sound. Uh, again, this is held by two screws. Um, the cover plates are held like this. And if you see, it is a double headed screw. So, I hope that is sharp enough for it to focus. And uh, it's it's two screws, and both sides you have uh, uh, you have a four crossed uh, screw. At the same time, you have two screws here in near the mouthpiece, and uh, it's very easy to maintain. Cleaning is very easy. Because these are non-valved, I think the easiest way to clean this particular harmonica, since everything is waterproof and uh, probably rust proof, what you can do is just open it, open up your uh, tap and if your water is clean, depending on which area you stay in, and you can just wash this through right under the tap and uh, dry it out by putting it on top of a cup or something like this. So, that is how you do it and I normally put some toothpicks into this when I just keep it half pressed. So that is about the maintenance and cleaning of this, it is very easy to clean. So if you are a beginner, I would suggest you go for uh, the forerunner to start off with and then slowly slowly upgrade to other instruments. This is completely hassle free and it does the job well, uh, it is a great sounding instrument and it is cheaper than uh, other models like. Uh, even if you compare it with East Top's other range, there are different comb materials in different quality and different grades. The more you spend, the better harmonica you get, of course. But this is the best value for money. I'll play it. So yes, being a non-valve, so of course you have to pump little bit of that extra air into this. But if you are a heavy, heavy player or if you blow really heavily into the mouth organ, then this would just be even better for you compared to others. And I did start off with uh, King Dream uh, from East Top and then I bought this one next. And again, this is with my son now and uh, that's his first go-to harp and it sounds just perfect. So that's about it. So just to summarize, good construction, airtight, uh, non valved uh, I think phosphor bronze reed plates and uh, cover plates has a very nice feel to it, comes in a great box. And price wise, I think this would be somewhere between, uh, depending on where you stay, say 150 dirhams to 180 dirhams which is uh, equivalent to somewhere between uh, 3000 to 4500 rupees in India and uh, that is somewhere less than less than uh, 40 dollars roughly depending on where you stay and shipping etc. So yes, a budget harp, good value for money and uh, good sound. And uh, just to clear out the doubts, if you have watched my other videos on the King Dream, um, in terms of comparison of King Dream and the Forerunner, I would say if you are having your budget, which you can stretch it a bit extra, then definitely go for the King Dream or even Forerunner. Both of these harmonica for value for money, that is the only deciding factor for me. And of course, King Dream sounds a bit better and of course, it is a valve harmonica and this is a non valve so, it is all about the price. So, depending on what you are willing to spend or I think take either one of these and it is just perfect. In my next videos, I will be doing reviews about some other professional grade harmonicas, something towards the likes of Honor or towards um, maybe a Suzuki or something. So, until next time, thank you very much. 
if you like the video please don't forget to subscribe like and uh, comment below thank you very much